Hello. Good evening. Good evening, Mr. Mauricio. Good evening, Miss Esmeralda. Hello, hello. Hello. Casi no los escucho. Hello. Hello, Mr. Mauricio. I cannot hear you. No, let's put you, Mr. Let's wait a few seconds. Hello, Miss Sandra. Hello, Miss Rebecca, welcome. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you, Miss? Hello, Miss. I'm fine, thank you. Nice, nice, nice. And you? I'm good. Thank you for asking, Miss. Hello, Miss. Lady, welcome. Hello, Miss Andrea, welcome. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Nice and good. That's good. Good, good, good. To start the week. Hello, teacher. Hello, mister. No le escuchaba, mister. Oh, I see. Tenía problema con el, con el micrófono. Oh, I'm sorry, mister. I ready for class. Ah, that's great. Great, great. Good, good. Yes. Yeah. Just give me one second. Um, I, if you can, please have two devices. I forgot to let you know. Se me pidió avisarles que si podían tener dos, dos dispositivos. Because you are going to need it for the class. Porque lo van a necesitar para una actividad que les tengo preparada. So we need another, another like thing. But anyways, let's wait one more minute. For the other ones, maybe they come. Okay, so I think it's already three minutes. Hello, Mr. Jorge Antonio. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Thank you. Nice. How are you, Mr.? Fine, thanks. And nice. you? Nice. I'm good. Thank you for asking, Mr. Okay. Good. Okay, let's start with today's class. Vamos a iniciar con la clase del día de ahora. So today we have a lot of fun activities to do and many things to learn. Okay, so... Let's go with English for our program. This is basic module number four. My name one more time is Lisa Rosmer Alvarado Martinez. And today it is Monday, November 7, 2022. Okay. And uh, we are going to continue with unit number three, that it is customer service. Okay. And um, with this, we are going to practice a little bit of uh, today uh, with customer details about a problem okay and you have to provide a solution and also we are going to practice the uh, questions with the simple past and um the answers that you have to give with the simple past okay vamos a continuar con el pasado eh, tiempo pasado and also with the questions with this con las preguntas que debemos de hacer y cuáles son las respuestas respuestas, las posibles respuestas that we can give. So let's start with some questions time uh, because last 
class, we were studying yes, yes no questions, right? Estuvimos practicando y estudiando las eh, simple past questions, but using um, the yes and the no. So we are going to review that. Vamos a practicar eso. And so it says, work as a class, they term, do the questions and do your best as always. Okay, so let's start. These are the questions, okay? Some of the questions, right? Recuerden que vamos a preguntar acerca de las cosas que ya sucedieron, o sea, acerca del, del past, del pasado. So here we have, okay, aquí tenemos eh, like two, what, three examples, okay? And, and, Like, for example, remember about yesterday. Vamos a hacer preguntas acerca de el día de ayer o del fin de semana. Like, for example, I can do, Miss Rebecca, did you have breakfast yesterday, Miss? Yes, I did. Oh, great. And did you drink coffee? No, I didn't. Ah, very good. So like that, you have to do a question to one of your classmates. Van a hacer una pregunta así con el DIR este, acerca del día de ayer a sus compañeros. So, Miss Rebecca, I already did one question to you. Can you do a question to Miss, Mr. Jorge Antonio, please? Don Jorge. Uh -huh. Did you eat pupusa? Yesterday? Yes, I did. Okay, thank you, Mr. Jorge. Can you do a question to Miss Sandra, please? Sandra. Anything about Sandra. yesterday? Mm -hmm. Okay, did you watch TV yesterday? Yes, I did. Okay, Miss Sandra, can you do a question to Mr. Mauricio, please? Mr. Mauricio. Hello. Did you <clears throat> dance yesterday? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. Okay, perfect. Thank you. What you did dance? <laughs> Mr. Mauricio, can you do a question to Miss Lady, please? Miss Lady, mm -hmm. did, did you go a beach yesterday? To the beach? To the beach yesterday? Yeah, very good. No, I didn't. Okay. okay. Miss Lady, can you do a question to Mr. Juan Jose? Welcome, Mr. Mr. Juan Jose, did you visit the family yesterday? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. Oh, nice. Very good. Okay, so that was a little bit for the just no questions and the practice because remember that we were doing that on Friday and also we were practicing the where, right? Where, that was mm -hmm. uh, where and was questions, right? That, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> where and was Estuvimos haciendo el where y el was también, que era para las yes no questions, like, were you happy yesterday, or maybe were you in Metro Centro yesterday, or something like that, about places, right, or feelings, or occupations. Eh, Mr. Juan José, can you do a question to Miss Abigail, please? Con el where, o seguimos con el eh, did? Uh, you can do with anything, did, or was, or where, as you like. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. Did you go to supermarket the last Friday. Oh, okay. Yes, I did. Oh, nice. Thank you for sharing me, Abigail. Let's go and continue with the next activity. And as I told you before, I wanted you to uh, have another device. Pues les solicité que si podían tener otro, otro, otro dispositivo because I want to practice a little bit of the simple past verbs, but it's with another device, so you need it. I don't know if you can have it. No sé si tienen otro dispositivo por ahí que puedan utilizar para la siguiente actividad. Yes or no? Because I will send you a link. Les voy a enviar un link, okay? 
So wait, structure pace. No. For a second. Okay, so I am going to come ahead. So. Oh, okay. So like this, okay, you're going to go to the, this is the, the link that you're joining my, wait. So you're going to go to join my, my quiz.com, that com, and then you have to enter this code. It didn't ingresar este código, please. Because we are going to practice the past tense of the verbs. Okay, and how are we going to do it? You will see uh, there. So you will see some sentences and then you will have to select the correct one. So let's see. So, La dirección, perdón, teacher, es joinmyquiz.com yes. o solo myquiz? No, joinmyquiz.com. Okay. okay, I have Miss Rebecca there. Thank you, Miss. The link is joinmyquiz.com and then there you have to enter this code, this code over there. Miss Lady. I can introduce your number también, teacher. Yes, please. Join my quiz and then there uh, you have to put your name. Hello, Miss Anya. I say join game and ponen el código like 293-900, join again, and then you put your name, y escriben su nombre, okay? Mister. Okay, no problem, miss. Okay, I have Mrs. Esmeralda, Mr. Jorge, Mr. Mauricio, Juan Jose, but I'm missing some of you. Miss Sandra, I have seven. I'm missing Miss Abigail. I am missing Miss, only Miss Abigail. Miss Abigail, are you going to play? No puedo ingresar. ¿Dónde registrarse me pongo? ¿Dónde registrarse? No, Miss. No, arriba le va a salir un, un, un que le parece Enter a Game Code. Mm. En WhatsApp también envié el link para Join My Quiz. Timmy's or not, you couldn't. Okay, I'm gonna start, okay, vamos a iniciar. And for this, uh, you will see some sentences, van a ver la oración y deberán de seleccionar el verbo correcto in the simple past, okay? So let's go, go ahead and let's get started, okay? So here we have the first one. Last night, my mom. I'm missing Mr. Mauricio and Mr. Juan Jose. 
Okay. Okay. <laughs> let's see. Let's see who has it correct. So, okay. So, oh my goodness, Miss Lady was the fastest one. Miss Lady fue la primera en contestar. And it was, my mom explained, okay? Eh, because the other ones were incorrect. Las otras estaban incorrectas. Very good job, though. Let's see. Let's continue. Question number two. Aquí está. Two nine, aquí está Miss. Two nine three nine zero zero. Lo mandaré en WhatsApp. Two nine three. Okay, I'm missing Miss Mauricio and Miss Sandra. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so oh nice, Miss Rebecca. So in this one is the athlete, the athlete was tired because she did a lot of exercise. Very good. Let's go ahead and continue. Missing Mr. Juan Jose. Mm -hmm. Oh no, it's missing Mr. Mauricio now. Mr. Mauricio. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. I. Hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. Miss Rebecca still on top. Nice. So I wrote a letter, okay? That's the past. Le puede empezar a preguntar los verbos, ya vi. <laughs> Let's see next one. The little girl. Lady Mauricio and Miss Sandra. Okay, nice. Let's see. The little girl. Nice. Almost had a party with all the characters of the movie Encanto. Nice, nice. Uh, uh. Had, exactly. The past for have. Okay, this one. Miss Sandra, oh, Miss Lady, last Friday we. Oh, what happened, Miss Lady? No me cambió. Really? Last sí. Friday we bought, we brought, sorry, a lot of toys. Mm, that's weird. Maybe it's the internet. I'm sorry, Miss. Okay, this one. I. Yes, I. Look. Ooh. Nice, Ms. Rebecca. Wow. I took exactly. Thank you, Mr. <laughs> Very good. Let's see next one.
My little sister was crying because she. Miss Rebecca, Mr. Mauricio, Miss Sandra. She fell down during process, okay? Very good. The main character of the movie. Okay, so in this one was nice, very good. Spoke, I spoke very little. Science class, we. Nice, very good. Let's see. It's made, we made a video on green screen. Amazing. And the last one, let's see. Last week, I. Excellent. Let's see, last week I... Okay, so... Visited my grandparents. Okay, let's see. This is a day when doing... Yes. Okay, let's see who is the first place. Vamos a ver quiénes son los primeros lugares. So let's give me one second because I don't know what is that happening. Oh, wait. Okay, first place is Miss Rebecca. Second place is Mr. Juan Jose. Third place, Mr. Jorge. Wow, well done, you guys. Awesome, you did that. Excellent, excellent. Okay, and then he was a review. I can see the answers for you. That was perfect. Thank you for practicing with me. Gracias por participar and practicar, okay, with this activity. Now we are going to do the attendance section. Vamos a hacer la sección de asistencia. Please say presente. Abigail Mejia. Andrea Amalia. I think she's mm, visual. Well, well, she's muted. I mean, no visual. Thank you, miss. Uh, Daniel Isbet, also, I think. Dilcia Yamilet. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss Dania. Esmeralda del Carmen. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge, ah no, Francisco Ernesto. Jorge Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Ezequiel. Juan Jose Herrera. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenya Elizabeth. Lady Xiomara. Present teacher. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Mirna Elizabeth. Rebecca Guadalupe. Present. Thank you, Sandra Abigail. Present. Thank you, Sandra Patricia. Present teacher. Thank you, Stephanie Michelle. Okay. Thank you, everybody.
for doing the attendance section with me, okay? And now we are going to continue. And what happened here? I have a message. Oh, thank you, Miss Kenya. I didn't saw it before, Miss Kenya. Okay, I do have it now. Okay, so let's move on. Now we have already done a little bit of practice for the past, as you can see. And now we are going to continue. Today, as I told you at the beginning, we are going to talk about how complaining, we are going to use the questions, okay, many more things. But give me one second, a second, so I can present to you my manual, but something happened to my manual. I don't know where is it. So, wait a second, 35. Okay. I know here. Okay, so here we have the manual and we are going to continue with this unit number three as we were studying last class, right? Vamos a continuar eh, con la unidad número tres, that is customer service. As you can see here, we have a question that says, uh, questions, I want you to tell me some questions that you do to your customers to ask about more information about the problem that they have. What questions do you do? When we want to know about the problem that they have with the product, what questions do you do? Like for example, one question it could be, what happened? Okay, what happened with the product? Another question that you could do to the customer. Mm -hmm. Do you have any problem with the product? Ah, do you have any problems with the product? Excellent. Any other question that you would do? Uh -huh. ¿Qué preguntas le hicieran a, a los clientes para eh, obtener más información sobre algo que tal vez no funciona? Like, what, what, what questions would you, would you do? Did you read the manual? Ah, oh, did you read the manual? The manual? Mm -hmm. Anything else? Uh -huh. About the problem, to ask questions about the problem. Miss Lady, Miss Rebecca, Mr. Mauricio, uh -huh. what questions will you do to know more about the problem? Do you have mm -hmm. any problem with device? Oh, like the other one. Okay, do you have any problems with the device? Okay, or oh, what problems, right? What problems yeah. do you have? What problems do you have? And other ones more, right? Now yeah. here, well, as you can see, we have a, like a email, right? About a customer's problem. Tenemos ahí como un correo. They are talking about a problem. And I would like, please, can you help me to read? Um, can you help me, please, Miss Rebecca, to read the, this little email, please? Just okay. the first section. Just the first section, and then I will ask somebody else. Please, thank you. <laughs> to Peter T. Mm, how do you say arroba? At Miss at at, at gmail.com. Subject complain about a trip yeah. from 
Hazel point R at Gmail. Gmail. I think they had a meeting. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, yeah, 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 that come. That come. And thank you. Continue, Mr. Jorge. Thank please. Thank you. Mm, sorry, teacher. Last uh, week. The last they, week. Yeah. Okay. Last week I had the change chance to travel with your company to another country. Mm -hmm. But to the honest with you, mm -hmm. it was a bad experience because the bus that you assigned me in didn't have AC or air conditioner. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a long trip and the bus was very slow. Mm -hmm. I am considering not traveling with you again because of the inconvenience I have. Very good. Thank you, Mr. Okay, so as you can see in this email, uh, this person is complaining, right? Uh, because of the things that the problem that the bus had, right? Está quejándose del bus, ¿verdad? The AC, el aire acondicionado, and then he says it was very slow, and also it was a long trip, and, and it's never traveling again with them, he says. So very good. Thank you for helping me to read. And then now, it, any words that you don't identify from this text? No sé si hay alguna palabra que no, que no identifiquen por de ese texto. That you want to help? Okay, nothing. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm eating a candy because I have a sore throat. It's so bad right now, okay? So sorry for that. Me voy a comer un dulce porque tengo un gran dolor de garganta, no se imaginan, y no puedo ni hablar, me duele. So, um, so right now it says here, with the next question, uh, what did the passenger, where did the passenger go, sorry? According to the reading, where did the passenger go? Went. Hmm? Went. It says here, where did the passenger go? Where? To Abort other country. Exactly. He or she, let's see, he or she went to another country. Thank you, mister. Number two. In number two, it says, "What did? Why did the passenger consider it a bad experience? What it was an a bad experience?" The bus. Mm -hmm. The bus mm -hmm. was very low. Mm. The bus was very slow. What else? Didn't have a um, AC. Didn't have AC. They it didn't have an AC. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Mm -hmm. The trip was long, right? Because he says it was long. So, right? The last one. What did the passenger send? What did the passenger? I think it's where. What did the passenger send that email? Why? Maybe why? Why did the passenger send the email? What do you think he sent it? To do what? Mm -hmm. ¿Por qué creen que envió ese correo? Mm -hmm. Because the client the bad experience. Mm. But what's the name for the bad experience? Mm -hmm. In the travel. Mm -hmm. Because he wanted to explain 
to give a complaint better. To give a complaint because remember, uh, yeah. complain. Um, remember that he was complaining, okay, about the trip, right? Y de hecho ahí en el, en el subject it says complain about a trip, okay? Oh, it's with T. I forgot to write the T. Okay, so it was a complaint. Cuando se hace, um, well, in English, right? When you want to make a um, queja, it would be a complaint. Because as you can see, si todo era negativo, entonces era una queja, ¿verdad? So in English, it's a complaint. Questions so far about this? Okay, if you don't have any questions, now, right now, I'm going to continue with the next topic that will help you to, to answer these kind of questions que nos ayudarán a practicar y a utilizar este tipo de preguntas. So, as you can see, they are in the past. And we are going to learn and practice simple past questions, okay? But in these ones are WH questions, okay? WH questions that are very important to get more information, right? Estas WH questions, recuerden que son muy importantes. ¿Por qué? Porque obtenemos más información al momento de hacerlas. Y las que estábamos realizando y practicando el viernes solo eran de yes, I did, no, I didn't, right? What would be the order for these type of questions? As you can see here, first we have the the WH questions. Which ones are the WH questions? Or WH were, when, where, who? Can you remember any other WH question that you remember? That, why. That or what? What? Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Why? Mm -hmm. What time? Mm -hmm. Which? Mm -hmm. Who? Mm -hmm. Who's, who, who is already, who's, how, right? How. Mm -hmm. Another one. How many? Mm -hmm. How much? Yeah. Excellent. How time long? How time long or how long? How time how long? Como no. cuánto tiempo? How long it would mm -hmm. be means. So how long only? Mm -hmm. That's perfect, thank you. So very good, so those are some of the WH questions. And then what happens in the WH questions words in simple past, after we use the, um, the WH word, we are going to use the did, okay? Siempre después de la WH question, lo que vamos a hacer es utilizar el did, and then you're going to use a subject and then you're going to use the base form of the verb. Like we have, like we have over here, we have many examples like, when did the ambulance arrive? Or maybe it can be, where did the accident happen? Or who did you call? Remember, this is the exactly, order that we are going to use for the next questions that we are going to create. How do we answer to these kind of questions? So, wait. Oh, here we have some more examples. So as I told you before, we give full answers. Can you help me to read these examples, please? Me, Sandra, number one. When did you see the movie? Mm -hmm. The movie? And that's a like WH question, right? But then here we have a, like, like the, the difference. It would be like this. Can you help me to read Miss Abigail? Did they write their project? Exactly. Thank you, Miss. As you can see that there is a difference because in the other one, we only have did right to, to do the question and it's only yes or no. Wait, I think I have more information. 
The same as the other ones, así como las anteriores. El, um, with the questions with the D, we can use also with was, ok? También podemos hacer eh, preguntas con el was. Like for example, what was Anna's favorite lesson? Remember that in this case, we don't use other verbs, ok? En este caso, no vamos a utilizar otro verbo. Solo el was o el where. And here we have another one. Where were you at five? At five? Okay. Let's see another one. I think I have some more information. Okay, so just to sum up and do our own examples. Ya solo vamos a hacer aquí una último like practice. And, and it says that with the other verbs, okay, we have the WH question, then you use the did, you use a subject, and then you use a verb, right? Can you help me to read these examples, please, Mr. Jose Ezequiel? Welcome, Mr. Yes, teacher. Good Thank evening, you. everyone. Uh, Good evening. Yes. What did you, what did you study? Mm -hmm. Where did you buy? And this PCF from. Did mm -hmm. she enjoy the class? Exactly. Did she enjoy the class? That's one type, right? And the other type that we have it with the word was or where. And in this case, we are not going to use did, right? Can you help me to read, please, the examples, Mr. Juan Jose? Okay. Mm -hmm. Who was your favorite teacher? Mm -hmm. Why were they late? Exactly. Thank you. In this case, as you can see, first we use the WH question, then you use the was or where, and then you use uh, something, depending. It could be a place, it could be a, a time, it could, it could be a, a name, an age. Pues, recuerden que con el was y el where puede ser una, un lugar, eh, maybe una hora, puede ser una nacionalidad, una ocupación, right? And so let's go. And now we are going to do a little bit of practice. But first, let me explain you a little bit of this. Just give me one second so I can go to the whiteboard. Okay, vamos a irnos a la whiteboard so you can see a little bit. Okay. Okay, here we have it. Okay, so remember, we have two types of WH questions, right? The first one is the one we use with the did, and also we use another verb, right? And the other one is, ¿cuál es el otro tipo de WH question que tenemos? Mm -hmm. Was and yes, sir. exactly, thank where? you. Me. Mm -hmm. With the was in the where, and we don't use any other verb, right? You know, se utiliza otro verbo. And how do we create it? Como las creamos con el did first. Okay, first we have the WH question, like for example, what did, después un sujeto, por ejemplo, what did you? What do you, can you tell me one verb, please, base form? Cook. Ah, what did you cook? And then how do we answer? Como vamos a responder? Con una oración en pasado. So for example, you, in this case, it would be, I cooked hmm, lasagna, okay? Because that's the verb, as you can see here. Uh, it says cook, right? So it would be I cooked and then what? Lasagna. Let's do another one. Where did they, can you tell me one verb please in base form? Come. I'm sorry, one more time. Come. Come. Like that? To university. Hmm. Where did they come? They 
came to the university. Very good, Miss. Thank you. But remember that we have to give full answers. Recuerden que tenemos que dar respuestas completas, ¿ok? Hmm. When? When did she? Can you tell me one verb, please? Miss lady. Uh huh. Yeah. When did she dance? <clears throat> it would be she, she dance. Uh huh. What happened? No, look at the question. When, Miss? The last Saturday. Mm, very good. Thank you. Last Saturday. She last. She danced. Sorry last Saturday. Aquí recuerden que utilizamos las time expressions de past, right? Last year, last month, yesterday, last night, yesterday morning, okay? Let's do another one. Hmm. How did, did you, how did you, can you tell me one verb, please? Mm -hmm. One verb, Miss Lady. Win. Oh, thank you, Miss. Win. That one, Miss. Win. Sí. Okay. Win. How did they? How the game. Did, ah, how did you win the game? Okay. And how do we answer? ¿Cómo vamos a responder? I won. I won the game. Uh huh. How? Mm, mm, with my ability. Mm, okay, mm -hmm. with my abilities. Yeah, I could be. Thank you, Mil. And look, we have the simple past sentence. Well, also to hear uh, the game. And then how? It's like this. With my abilities, right? How? That's the how. Questions for this? Questions on to this point? Let's see. <laughs> Where did they go? Where do you think they go? Mm -hmm. Where do you think could be the answer? They went to the beach. Okay, thank you. What about the other ones? They went to shopping. Ah, they were, they were, or they went. Went. Uh huh. Shopping. Mm, okay. They went shopping. Mm -hmm. And you there idea? Okay, so in this case, I have three options. They went shopping, they go shopping, they go shopping. What's the answer, A, B, or C? A. A. Yeah, <laughs> very good. What about the next one? No, wait, this is not the answer. What did, I'm sorry, I cannot see it. Wait a second. What did he do? What it can be the answer? He, mm -hmm. he played he soccer. soccer. Okay. He played soccer. Anything else? Okay. Uh, he okay. practiced the soccer. Oh, very good. <laughs> okay, I have he plays football, he plays football, or he plays football. Let it be. Okay. okay. Yes. 
What did she do? She um, ride the bicycle. Okay, she ride the bicycle. What about the other ones? What do you think? She practice. How do you say athletism? Uh, athletism. Athletism, right? Let me search for it. But is that athletism? I don't think so. Athletics. Athletics. But I don't think that is athletism, but I don't know. Athletics. Uh, any other idea? I haven't heard so many of you talking. For example, Mr. Jorge, Mr. Mr. Jose, Mr. Juan Jose, Miss Lady. Mm -hmm. Any ideas for this picture? Rebecca? She Mm -hmm. She rolled bicycle. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, so for this one, I do have, let's see. She ride her bike. She rode her bike. She ridden her bike. Option B. B. She rode her bike. Very good, excellent. What did she did he do? He played the drum. Ah, drums. Okay, oh, very good. Oh, drum. Exactly, very good. Any other ideas? He learned to play the drums. Okay. He learned to play the drums. Very good. Nice, nice. Okay, I have three options again. He playing the drums, he plays the drums, he played the drums. Okay. He played the drums. Yes, very good. What's the next one? Okay, let's go with the next ones. And the next ones are they. Ahora vamos con. ¿Sí pueden ver la, la whiteboard? Yes. yes. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now we are going with the, the WH questions with was and where. What happened? So in this case, Remember that we are going to ask like about the place, we are going to do a questions about the occupations, about the occupations, nationalities, what else? Places, name, age, okay? About the past, obviously. Like for example, where were you, uh, where were you, for example? That's a question and that's it. Where were you? And then maybe we can ask uh, like a time expression, like yesterday. Okay. Esta es una doble H question que está preguntando acerca de dónde vea. Y podemos agregar una doble H, una time expression como yesterday. Okay. Para darle un poco más de énfasis, right? Like for example, where were you yesterday? And then you can say, 
I was in my house. Okay. Another one. It could be what? Hmm. What was your mother? What was your mother? I'm gonna this one. I don't know how to do it. What was your mother? What's your mother's occupations? Okay. Let's say that your your mom used to work and now she doesn't work. So what was your mother's occupation? Okay. What how do we answer to this question? ¿Cómo podemos responder a ese tipo de pregunta? What was your mother's occupation? My, My mother, mother mm -hmm. is a, was a nurse. Ah, my mother was a nurse. Exactly. Thank you, mister. Because in this case, remember that we are using the WH question that we are using was or where. In este caso, utilizo el was porque estoy hablando de ella, right? And then occupation. And look in this sentence, in the answer, my mother was, and then you have the occupation, right? Nurse. When was, hmm, when was, what can we say? Ah, the concert. When was the concert? Daddy Yankee's concert. <laughs> <laughs> and how do we, how can we answer to this? Uh-huh. The concert. Uh-huh. So, sería. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Uh, wonderful. In... Oh, very good. Pero in this case is when. When. Uh -huh. ah, okay. Si le hubiera puesto what. Last uh -huh. How? Friday. Okay. Friday. No fue Saturday. 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 Uh -huh. Saturday. Saturday. Ya dije mm, Friday. No, porque ustedes estaban en clase y se acabaron. <laughs> <laughs> the concert was sat on Saturday. Exactly. On Saturday. Or maybe how, uh, where, how, where, my goodness, what can we say? What can we ask? How, where, the parties, okay, the parties, or the carnavalitos here in Sami. Okay, so we can answer. ¿Cómo respondemos acá? Let's see. How were the parties? So in this one, uh, it would be about plural, as you can see. Okay. The parties were. Uh huh. The parties. Very funny. Ah, very. Mm -hmm. Where? Fun, maybe. Very funny. Very, but why very funny, Miss? Very fun. Very fun. Ajá, funny sería divertido, pero de chistoso, ¿ok? Y fun, eh, divertido, just divertido, ¿ok? Like, for example, like something that you're describing, you're going to say, like, un objeto que tú estés, estés describiendo, tú vas a decir fun, ¿ok? Pero si quieres decir eh, cómo es una persona, un animal, vas a decir funny, ¿ok? So, very fun, ¿ok? That would be the difference. Um, so, yeah, so any questions? Yes, yeah, very good, Miss. Sí, en este caso de acá de what was your mother's occupation? You can say um, her, her occup, uy, ¿qué estoy haciendo? Her occupation, vamos a ver acá, también podría hacer eso. Her occupation, no, si no quieren decir, vea, occupation. Mm -hmm. Her occupation was a teacher, for example. Okay. That could be another type of answer. Perfect. Aquí también el de concert, por ejemplo, pudiera haber sido, it was on Saturday. Y acá, how were the parties? ¿Cómo podríamos, en vez de the parties, ¿cómo podríamos haber dicho? They. Ajá, they were very fun, right? Perfect, thank you. Questions, doubts, comments, right now it's the time. Questions, tell me, tell me.
Okay, so no questions. I guess it's clear as the water. Not as clear as our, our water of our chat. It's clear as it's clear as as the water clear clear. <laughs> Let's see. Wait a second. I just want to check on something. Oh my goodness, what happened? Okay, so in now we have a little bit of practice. Okay. In the manual, give me one second. In the manual, as I told you before, they only have the did questions, okay? But I am teaching you the other way with the was and where, right? In the manual, pues, solo nos aparecen las preguntas con el did, pero pues yo les estoy mostrando también con el was, okay? So you can learn many, many more things. Miss Lady, can you help me to read the information questions, please? But the first two and the answers. Thank you. Okay. Um, um, yes, please. Okay. What did you buy? I bought a vacation pig. Thank you. Uh huh. Where, Next one. Where did he fly to? He flew to another country. Yes, very good. Help me with the last. Next ones too, please, Mr. Jorge. Okay, teacher. Wait. Um, when did we pay for the service? Mm -hmm. We paid for the service last month. How did they find out of that promotion? They found out, they found out about in, on it on internet. Exactly. Thank you. As you can see in these ones, well, they are using again the same uh, structure that I was teaching you. Uh, the, the WH question or WH word, then did, and then we have the subject and the verb, right? And to answer, remember to use the, um, the simple past sentences, right? And let's go ahead. And we have a little bit of practice there in your manual, as you can see here. We have five questions. What do we have to do? It's, it says complete the email using prepositions. Or what? No. In this one, you have to create um, questions, okay? Uh, using simple past. As you can see, you have the beginning of the questions. Como pueden notar, tienen el principio de la pregunta. But we have to complete with the verb and something else, right? Like, for example, what did you, hmm. In this one, it could be, what did you buy on the supermarket, let's say. It could be, right? And then I can answer, ¿Cómo podemos responder a esa pregunta? What did you buy in the, what did you buy on the supermarket? I, I bought, uh -huh, I bought uh -huh. the grocery. The groceries, okay, perfect. Thank you, miss. I brought the groceries. And then uh, that's what you have to do, okay? You have to complete. Uh, with the uh, just verbs as you want that have obviously they have um, like relationship okay and for this I'm going to give you five minutes so you can complete this section okay section number five questions okay so let's do it complete it please complete this uh, five questions
two more minutes. Ready? How do you say um, discoteca? Club. Can you say club? Mm, can you correct? I wrote it there. Can you see it right now? In the, in the, the manual over there? Yes. Okay, perfect. Ready? Nobody says finish. I don't know if you're finished. Are you finished? Not yet. Not ready yet. Raise your hand if you're finished, please. So we can just finalize. Raise your hand, raise your hand. Nobody? Okay, that's okay. Thank you, Miss Abigail. Oh, thank you, Miss Rebecca.
Nobody else finish? Okay, let's see. I'm gonna try number one. What do you have, Mr. Mauricio, for number one? What answers what what how do you complete it, number one? Mr. Mauricio? Hello. Okay, Miss, what about then Miss Rebecca, how do you how do you complete the number one, Miss? What did you go on weekend? What did what do you go? Are you sure that go goes with what? Hmm. Ah yes. Mm -mm. Maybe mm -hmm. where, right? Maybe where, but now what? What about you, Mr. Juan Jose? What do you have at number one, mister? What do you buy in Amazon? Ah, oh, very mm -hmm. good. Thank you. I what? bought a new headset. Ah, uh, in Amazon. Okay. Somebody has a different one from that one? Alguien tiene algo diferente como, what do you buy in Amazon? Do you have... Miss Abigail? What do you have, Miss Abigail? Or maybe... Uh, <laughs> what did you dance last night? I danced bachata last night. Mm, excellent. Last night. Thank you. What about number two? What do you have for number two, Mr. Jose Ezequiel? The question, what do you wrote over there? Mr. Jorge Antonio, then, what do you have in number two? Um, I, I don't know if that's okay. Um, I wrote, mm -hmm. how did you cook the eggs? Ah, yes, it's perfect. Mm -hmm. How do you cook the eggs? Thank mm -hmm. you, Mr. And how do you, what's the answer that you have? I cook fried eggs. Oh, very good. Fried eggs. Fried, uh -huh. uh, fried eggs. How do you learn English? That's very good, Miss Kenya. Learn English. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Miss. Number three. What do you have in number three, Miss Lady? Why did you choose mm -hmm. this work? This work. Oh, very good, Miss. Thank I you. Choose, uh -huh. mm -hmm. I choose it's near my house. Ah, because it's near your house. Very good. Miss Rebecca, number three. What do you have for number three, Miss? Why did you buy chicken? What did you buy? Chicken. chicken. Oh, very good. What's the answer that you have? Uh, because I had a craving. Antojo. Ah, crave. Okay, very good. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see next one. And can you help me please, Miss Abigail? Number four. Where did you? From Mr. Mauricio? Uh... Where did you visit it at your family? Where did you visit it? You visit your family, maybe? Visit your family. Uh huh. And what's the answer that you that you give? I, uh -huh. I visited my family her house. Oh, very good. Where did you travel last one? Excellent, Mr. Mauricio. Thank you. Let's see. Where did you? Travel last month, it says Miss Kenya. Travel last month. Excellent. What's the answer, Miss Kenya? Let's see next one. Hello, Mr. Francisco. Welcome, Mr. I don't know if you are listening to the explanation. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. No sé si estaba escuchando la explicación, Mr. No, 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 no. 
Voy uniendo, oh, voy uniendo. Oh, okay, I get it, get it. No problem, mister. Miss, right. thank you. Uh, no problem. Where do you dance last name or last night? Where did you dance last night? I guess, I guess so, Miss. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Thank you. And then, who is the other one who is missing? Hmm. Mr. Juan Jose, number five, what do you have? Who did you? Who did you? Who did you see at movie? Ah. I saw my sister. Ah, very good at the movies. Thank you. Miss Lady, do you have a different one? Uh, no, no, easy. <laughs> oh, yeah, my goodness, Miss. Uh, so who, it's for Ken, right? What about Miss Rebecca? Do you have a question for it? Who did you? Who did you do this table? This table, okay, very good. Aunque el dude podría ser made, make mm, Pero es que depende, si le empezó de cero, miss, miss puede ser tú, o make, oh, okay. o, o puede ser también que se van preparándolo porque van a comer ahí, ¿verdad? Ah. Uh -huh. Maybe. Or set the table, for example. Set is como arreglar, poner los platos. Uh -huh. So, yeah, depends on what you want to ask. ¿Qué le puso de respuesta a mí? No la vi, no la hice. Uh, so you <laughs> said... Ahorita me la inventé. Ah, uh, who did you... Who did you do this table? You say, right? You, you can say, I did this table with my brother. It could be. Yes. Mm -hmm. Excellent, Miss. Thank you. What about you, Mr. Mauricio? What do you have for who? Who did you? I. Mm, who did you mm -hmm. buy this book? Ah, oh, buy this book. Excellent. This book I bought. Ah. Uh, With. This book. Uh -huh. I bought. A partner. I'm sorry, one more time. This book uh -huh. I bought a partner. With a partner. With, With a partner. partner. Very good. Vaya, cuando tenemos el why, pues vamos, después de la oración, me utilizamos el because, right? And with who, when we have who, to answer, we use with, ok, para responder necesitamos el with, okay. para decir con esta persona o con alguien más, right, okay. so we okay. have to use with, yes, thank you thank you everybody, okay. very good questions though, I love them thank you for doing it let's go and uh, let's go with the next activity give me one second so I can go to the next activity with you Okay, so right now we are going to think about our last vacation, okay? In our last vacation, so here, it says practice time, work individually, write about your last vacations. Then I'm going to put you in pairs, okay? And then you have to do questions, like for example, I'm going to write about my, my last vacation, okay? Yo voy a escribir acerca de mi last vacations. Uh, my last vacation... In my last, sorry, in my last vacation, oh my, I went to New York. And then let's see, New York. I visited my, my family, okay? I went to the Rockefeller Center, Rockefeller center i i met a new people new people i saw a celebrity celebrity and the, yeah okay so now 
let's see that this is my last vacation, right? And then what are you going to do? You have to do questions, okay? Ya escribí acerca, ustedes van a escribir más de, más de cinco oraciones, okay? Not just only five. You have to write at least seven lines, okay? Or 10, maybe 10 lines. And then if you listen to my last vacations, okay? Or if you can read there, esto de la, my last vacations, tienen que enviarlo en el grupo, okay? Why? Because for this one, you can do questions, porque así podemos hacer preguntas. Como por ejemplo, una de las preguntas sería, que me podrían hacer, where did you go for your last vacation? Last vacation. Oh, yo le contestaría, oh, I went to New York. Okay. ¿Qué otra pregunta podrían hacer con ese mini text que les acabo de hacer? Other question? Uh -huh. uh, how many days did you stay at New York? Ah, how many, uh, how many days did you stay? In New York, I stayed for eight days. It was a quick vacation that I have. Uh -huh. So I stayed for eight days. Any other questions? Who's the celebrity you saw there? Oh, great. Who is this? Who is or who was? Who was the celebrity? Celebrity. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, but who was the celebrity only? It could be who was the celebrity? The celebrity was, I don't know. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's say it was Iron Man. It was not Iron Man, but anything. You can see almost any celebrity there. Iron Man. I don't, Tony Stark, it would be. I forgot about his name right now. I don't know why. <laughs> Tony Stark, no, but what's the, what's the re, real name for Tony Stark? Robert. Ah, Robert. Thank you, Robert. Robert what? Robert. Donnelly Jr. Uh-huh, Downey Jr. It's true. Oh my goodness. Is your crush, Miss? <laughs> <laughs> because if you know the name, I don't I don't remember. Red Downey Jr. Yes. Okay. So and like that, right? As you can see, with the little vacation that I just wrote, you can do many questions. Okay. So what are we going to do right now? I'm gonna give you five minutes so you can write your about your last vacation, okay? write details like for example i ate ah i didn't wrote that what did i ate i ate some delicious food in there i ate some tacos <laughs> they were so delicious uh i didn't i didn't i didn't do ah uh, i didn't see the statue of literally that was sad because i wanted to see it Okay, I didn't, I didn't um, travel by, by bus. I didn't use the subway or many things, okay? So like this, okay? I want you to create um, seven line vacation, okay? About your last vacation, okay? So let's do it. Um, and, and then later send it in the, group okay oh wow you were quick i know i saw what's the questions okay so let's do it please if you have any questions let me know thank you miss abigail thank you miss rebecca too thank you mr juan jose okay mr jose Thank you, Miss Esmeralda.
Oh, I remember the celebrity was one of the One Direction said. <laughs> that was a celebrity that I saw. Miss. Yeah, tell me, Miss. Uh, how do you say infancia in English? Uh, childhood. I'm gonna childhood. send childhood. I'm gonna send it there in the chat. Okay, childhood. Finish. She is finish. She is finish, Mr. Juan Jose, or not yet? No, yet, teacher. Okay. So something happened this afternoon. Este, esta tarde pues nos sucedió algo lamentable con las cuentas de, de YouTube. And so, creo que todos los videos de, de YouTube se nos borraron. Entonces, este, creo que solo quedaron los de la plataforma. Quisiera que alguien de ustedes chequee ahorita. Este, que chequee ahorita en YouTube, porque alguien más está comentando que tampoco pueden ver los videos. Si alguien puede y me envía una, una captura. ¿De qué le aparece? Porque a mí me parece que no, no hay ningún contenido, dice. Porque si no, si no aparecen ahí, pues yo les trataría de enviar el link, lo podría subir a otro lado y se los podría enviar en, en el video, quiero decir, ¿verdad? Porque creo que el de día de ahora no sé cómo vamos a hacer para subirlo. But Miss Abby, it has to be seven lines. Explain more, please. Where it was the last vacation? Oh, you came to San Miguel? Where, miss? Where, what did you eat here in San Miguel? Did you eat pupusas with, with re, repollo de mayonesa con salsa negrita? Delicious. You should try it. It's delicious. The best of the best of El Salvador. <laughs> Miss Abby, did you eat that? Thank you, Mr. Jorge. This is my father. I went to the Pango Lake. I think it's a lake, right? It's a lago, right? Lupango. Sí, lago. So it's a lake. This is near to the San Salvador, right? Father's house. Father's house? My 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 father. Ah, your father's house. Oh, there, okay. there, yeah. My father lived in the Ilopango City. The Ilopangos Lake is near to the to the city. Oh, nice! That's great, Mister. In the last one, we were a good time. Maybe we had a good time. 
then the rest is perfect, Mr. Okay. Okay. Excellent. That's great, Mr. I, I can see that you said that if you had a run, right? Yeah. In like to go to the Lopango Lake? No, the run was in the El Salvador del Mundo. Mm. Okay, get mm -hmm. it. But is the same that they do like the like Ciclovia? Mm, yes, it's the ah. same. Ah, okay, great. I have been in the, the holidays. In the holidays in San Salvador, um, mm -hmm. uh, that um, 20, 21 kilometers. Oh my uh, goodness. Yeah. That's a lot. Yeah. That's awesome, Mr. Gray. And thank you for sharing. Okay. Mr. Mauricio. Eh, can you, um, I can see that you made the question. Don't do it. It was this, the, the text, Mr. A paragraph. Era un pequeño párrafo, Mr. Que va a escribir, Mr. Um, uh. Yes, about your last vacation. Can you write okay. it down? Yeah. Great, Mr. Juan Jose, thank you for sharing. Nice, Miss Rebecca. I love those those uh, enchiladas they make there with what's they say mole? No, it's not mole. It's another thing that they do, right, in Guatemala. But I don't remember the name. I don't remember. But they, that there's a delicious food there. I love it. <laughs> I love every food, anyways. <laughs> Pero no me acuerdo cómo se llama. It's not mole. Pozole. No, I don't know. I don't remember. Me confundo con los Mexicans. Se llaman igual. Can you check? Miss Rebecca, can you check if you have the YouTube channel? If you can see the videos on YouTube. Okay, I will check. Please, thank you. Porque acabo de ver y creo que hasta los de la plataforma se borraron. No. So, anyways, so. Bueno, vamos a ver si me, a mí le parecen. Si no les aparecen los videos, ¿ok? Y tienen alguna duda, porque recuerden que siempre es el video, ¿verdad? Tienen que verlo y después hacían la actividad. Entonces, la actividad de la práctica, de la clase, después de la clase. Si no entienden algo, inmediatamente me escriben y yo les puedo mandar otro video en el cual, este, porque después los míos, pues no sé cuándo van a ser capaces de, de subirlos. No sé si ahora o mañana en la mañana. Entonces ahí le voy a poder ayudar, así le voy a poder apoyar por el momento. Porque sí, ahorita todavía están explicando de que pues no se ha podido solucionar. Ya, pues sí, ya, ya hicimos varias cosas con nuestros correos, pero igual no, 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 no nos han dado acceso. No Teacher, yes. I see now video. You can see the videos? Yes. Can you send um, me a picture, please? Okay. Thank you. Porque ahorita está mandando una foto y aparece ahí video no disponible. It's super weird. But I cannot see nothing. I don't know what is happening. Oh, yes. Solo en el inicio no aparece. I think so, yeah. Who is this? Miss Lady. Oh, 
Oh, you went to Morazan. Do you like it, Miss? Do you like Morazan, Miss Lady? What do you think about Morazan? Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there, uh, yeah you can see in my face. <laughs> <laughs> What do you like about Morazan, Miss Lady? Um, no entiendo. What did you like about Morazan? Mm, el que me gusta Morazan. No, what did you like? Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 that one. Uh, el clima, no sé cómo se llama. Oh, the weather. Mm -hmm. The weather. Yes, I imagine. It's delicious there. And yeah. the pinos, and the pinos rice, right? delicious. It's very cold. Yeah, I love <laughs> it too. Mister, I went with my Mister. son. Yes? Uh, how many lines do we have to write? Five to seven. Five to seven, please. It's time for the attendance section. I forgot. Please say present everybody. Abigail Mejia. Andrea Amalia. Daniel Lisbeth. Present teacher. Thank you. Dice Yamilet. Esmeralda del Carmen. Present teacher. Thank you. Francisco Ernesto. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Ezequiel. Yes, Miss, I'm here. Thank you. Juan Jose Herrera. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenya Elizabeth. Thank you, Miss. Let's see, Lady Xiomara. Present teacher. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Mirna Elizabeth. Rebecca Guadalupe. Present. Thank you, Sandra Abigail. Miss Sandra se fue. What? Sandra Patricia. Present teacher. Thank you, Stephanie Mitchell. So it's not here. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for doing it. Okay. So um, I'm just. Algunos miss... videos se ven, teacher. No todos. No todos, pero son como dos que no alcanzo a ver yo. Okay. Los demás sí se ve. ok, great. That's good. Bueno, qué bueno, vea que no los perdimos todo. Because los demás están mandando fotos y todos se perdieron. But my, I, thanks the Lord, no. My last vacation, I went, I went to Mexico. Thank you, Miss Kenya, for sharing. Um, Mr. Francisco, just Mr. Francisco and Miss, ah, oh no, Miss Dania is oyente too. Oh, really? You went for the dead stay? Is it good, Miss Kenya? Nice, Miss Kenya. I love it. That's great. I went to this, my country. Oh, are you from the sorry, Mister? Yes. Of right course. now, right now, are you are you in San Salvador? No, teacher, I live here in Samuel. Oh, really? Yes. I didn't know. I didn't yes. know about it. Oh, great, mister. In the center, yes. Really? In, in with, with um, Colonia or? Uh, Barrio San Francisco. Oh, really? Yes. Nice. I know. Almost, like... <laughs> almost four blocks to the cathedral. Oh yes, you're near. Yes, I remember. You're near like the this church that is also called San Francisco, right? Yeah. And also is the the cinema. Oh my goodness, the name of this cinema. 
mundial. Yes, no, 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 the other one, Bar right? Bar mm. No, wait, yes. Gerardo Bar? No. Yo lo confundo. <laughs> yeah, me too, but there, that's, that one is, it's not el cine mundial, that's the other one, but the other one. <laughs> yeah, but I know where you say. Near the Cancha Alvarez, right? Yeah. Uh -huh, yeah, I know where. Oh, nice, mister. That's great. You are feeling in here in the in the hell. <laughs> what? You're yeah. living in the hell because you here is super hot. <laughs> In nada que llueve right now. We need rain. No, mister, it's super hot nowadays. These days, I want some wind and some a little bit of rain, not much. Nice, mister. But Cesori, is it cold, Cesori? I, I never been to Cesori. Sorry, miss. Is it cold, Cesori, or no? A little bit, teacher. Oh, nice. That's great. Yes. I, ne I had never been to Cesori. Yo nunca he ido a Cesori. It's not never. It's more, it's more than Samuel. Yes, definitely, mister. Here, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> you melt here. It's, oh, no. On Saturday, I know. I, in my weekends, I don't like it because it's hotter than the weeks, I don't know why, but anyways. Okay, so I think everybody finished. Okay, now only Mr. Francisco. So, wait, what happened? Who left? Mr. Juan Jose left. Okay, so let's see, we are right now, remember, what do you have to do? You have to do questions to your classmates. Okay, lo voy a poner con los que no están, bueno, los de oyente van a estar escuchando por ahí, pero los que no, Van a ser preguntitas, okay? You're going to do questions using the past about the text that you see. Ya sé que el texto que vean ahí que, que se enviaron en el grupo de WhatsApp. Okay, so let's see. Wait a second. Give me one second. So I think it will be one, two. One, two. Yes. Okay. So I think it like this. Give me one second. Mister, what happened? So Fred, you disappear. Okay. What happened? Miss Rebecca, are you there? Hi. Oh, okay, pensé que se había ido porque no la puedo asignar. What is happening out oh, there? Ahora sí, ya lo pude <laughs> Yes, I don't know what happened. Okay, so I'm going to put you to practice right now. Remember that you have to do questions with your classmates about the stories or the last vacations that they share in the WhatsApp group. Deben de chequear la historia del WhatsApp group para que puedan hacer preguntas. Así como, por ejemplo, uh, I can ask Miss Rebecca, Miss Rebecca, where did you go on your last vacation? Where did you go on your last vacation? I went to Guatemala. Skipulas. Exactly, exactly. Very good. Esquipulas, excellent. So like that, and then you continue, okay? Uh, do at least three questions. Por lo menos tienen que hacer three questions and write, that, write them down and write the answers. Deben de escribir también las respuestas que les den, okay? Questions and answers. Remember, for this activity, I'm going to give you five minutes, okay? Five minutes so you can practice, practice speaking and also write them down. So three questions and three answers for the questions, okay? Let's go and practice. Accept the invitation, please, thank you. Conversation? I start the conversation. Okay. I ask you, where did you go to the last vacation? 
I went to Guatemala. Oh, nice. Yes, I, I visit uh, Aurora Zoom, and then I stay in the at Port, uh, Quetzal Port. And and they uh, it's very it's very close to the San Jose Port. San Jose Port is very. Uh, my last vacation, I went to the horror Esabla. Sí. The horror Pacific Paradise. Okay. <clears throat> Comience usted. Pregúntame. <laughs> No, tú ya encontraste el mío hoy. Pregúntame tú acerca del. Ah. Bebidas y compra. Ah. What did you buy? We bought in the a lot of. Tipula. We bought a lot of sweet. Bought. A lot. Of uh, what? Sweet. Sweet. Okay. What do you buy? Sweets or candies? Or souvenirs? Dulcita. <laughs> <laughs> so that's okay. That's good. <laughs> Sweets then. That's Sweet. perfect. Okay. Uh, another one. With. Como, con quien fuiste? Who. ¿Cómo se dice? ¿Con quién fuiste? Who, who did you travel with? Say it again, please. Who, who, who did you travel? Ah, uh, did you travel? Rebecca? Who did you travel? ¿Con quién viajaste? Sola. Miss, you're muted. Rebecca. With my family. Uh, I. Okay. Thank you, Francisco. You're welcome, sir. You finish? Yes, yes finish. What? Remember yes, that you... Mr. Jorge, ask me. <laughs> but remember that you keep and then you, mister, have you done the questions? I don't have uh, me, teacher, I don't have any questions. <laughs> Why? You have to do questions. Because I I it doesn't the question only but, I the uh, huh? but you can use the you can use like the text that Mr. send in the WhatsApp group. Ah okay you can search for it and then you can do question from there. The both conversation teacher. Let me see. You finish? No, oh, teacher. Yeah. Okay. Where did you go the last vacation? Okay. Repasamos si quiere, Rebecca. Okay. Va. Where were you go in the in your vacation? Where were you I... go? Or where, where did you go? Where Where did you go? Mm. 
because you have go, that's another verb, remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where did you go in your vacation, Rebecca? I went to Guatemala. Oh. Esquipula. Esquipula, okay. Where did you eat? 